Oh, it's Jesse Priest here, and it's been a while. Going on about a year since I posted a video. A lot's changed. But anyway, I'm starting a new series on my YouTube channel now. And it's going to be called In the Dream with Jesse Priest Music. The reason I've decided to call it is In the Dream is because, uh, uh, you know, for years now I've been telling folks that uh, I'm going to do music for a living. And, uh, you know, that's what I'm going to do with my life. Well, I'm proud to say I'm now living the dream. I have been now for going on three and a half years. And no, that doesn't mean fame and fortune. For me, living in the dream means I'm literally getting to do music every day of my life. I'm writing songs with some amazing artists. I've recorded albums, released my own music under myself, you know, independently and doing it on my own. And, uh, with a lot of help from some new friends that you guys are going to meet, David Vest being one of them. And uh, so, yeah, just uh, strap in, hang out with me, and uh, just enjoy this journey. We got a lot going on, and we got a lot to go over that you've missed. I love you guys, though, and I'm so excited to be back to doing this. Out with a new video. Here we are tonight playing at the Peerless Saloon in Anniston, Alabama. This is a familiar face for y'all. Old Danny Harvson, Daniel Harvson. So I told you guys, we got a lot of crazy new stuff going on. We're doing a live video, music video for these folks today. So we're excited about that. Good? That good? Well, that thing. Also acquired this beauty this will be my tour rig for a while she's a older rig but she's beautiful and she's mine and paid for so yeah I'm excited about it Whew. so finally got this video uploaded and I uh, hope you guys enjoyed it it's called in the dream um, there's been a few setbacks all that stuff you've seen has been from November um, I don't have much video footage from anything because, unfortunately, after Thanksgiving, the day after we lost my grandmother, um, she took her final few breaths here on Earth, and she began her celestial journey across the universe. And uh, um, we knew it was coming. Uh, it still sucked. So <clears throat> took a few weeks off, and... Uh, collect my thoughts, you know, and just, uh, was with the family and, uh, hanging out and, you know, learning life without grandma, um, after her being in my life every day for 30 years, almost 31 years, um, there was not a day that went by hardly that I didn't speak with her or go see her, and, uh, so it sucks, but, I know now more than ever, she's in no pain, and her and my grandfather are both getting to come to my shows, To um, finally. Um, I don't know that my grandpa ever really got to come to many of my shows. Um, he did get to watch me perform at graduation, so that was cool. But that's not what this video is about. It's about me saying, sorry guys, I haven't uploaded yet. It's here now. So this is the first episode of In the Dream. It's now uh, the day after Christmas on a Monday. I'm at work at the guitar store. I hope everyone had a very blessed and wonderful Thanksgiving. And I hope you all had a very, very Merry Christmas. And I hope y'all have a very Happy New Year. Um, I will be posting weekly. Um, I'm going to be posting weekly. So keep an eye out and hold me to it. Um, I know I've tried it before in the past, but like I said, just little tidbits on 
my version of living here in the dream from from my dream perspectives of getting to do music for a living and uh yeah so this is another new thing that's happened in my life um i work at guitars and more in coleman uh very very part-time they came to me and you know they're like hey you know if you're not gigging any and you'd like to pick up a shift here and there uh hit us up you know and we'll hit you up when we need some help um throughout the week or something and so it's been great i love these guys we have a great inventory we have some cool stuff for sure so you should come check us out if you're in the area you might get to see me um we had our first performance at puckett's the other night if y'all know what that is it's a very groovy little joint we uh, had a good time anywho just wanted to stop in and say sorry the video is late give you a little bit of a context of why the video was late and uh just tell you guys i love you guys thank you so much for all the support um as we're going into season three of jesse priest doing music for a living we're going into three years of uh doing this for a living we've been through a pandemic um i've been through loss and uh, uh now i've got some trouble going on with one of my legs i've got some cellulitis <laughs> uh, um so lucky me um but anywho it is lucky me because i love this life and i wouldn't trade it for anything it's the only one I got, so I'm holding on to everything and riding it until I can't ride no more. Anyway, love you guys again. Thank you so much. I still have some vinyls. I also have a um, private stock in a moonshine label. Um, it's called Roaring River Distillery. You should check them out. They have Jesse Priest's Alabama Bloodline Moonshine. It is strawberry. It is really, really good. Uh, their son Chad, he's the one that makes all the moonshine. He was actually on uh, a show the other day. I think it's called Master Distillers. I think that's what it was. So if y'all see Roaring River, hit them up. <clears throat> Go out there and uh, get you a bottle or hit me up on uh, the interwebs. And next year, we got a lot going on. There's another album coming. There's more videos coming. There's more songs coming. And I'm hitting it hard from every corner, from every aspect, because this is the life I chose and the life that I want to live and just enjoy every minute of it. And I'm documenting this for me, myself, and I, most part, so I can go back in 20, 30 years and say, that's where you were, man, and this is where you are today. Who knows where I'll be? I don't. <laughs> Anyways, you guys have a great rest of your week. Um, happy New Year. And uh, we'll see you guys in a few weeks. Well, no, we'll see you guys next week. After New Year's. We're starting off the New Year right. Bringing it in. Hold your family tight. Love your friends. Love your family. And uh, treat somebody nice today. They might need it. We'll catch you on the next one.